हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू द थर्टी एट एपिसोड ऑफ जुमला टू पॉइंट फाइव कस्टम कॉम्पोनेंट डेवलपमेंट सीरीज इन द प्रीवियस लेसन वी हैव लर्न हाउ टू क्रिएट डिफरेंट टाइप ऑफ व्यू फॉर्मेट विद इन योर व्यू एंड वी हैव क्रिएटेड रॉ व्यू टाइप जेसन व्यू टाइप एज वेल एज एच टी एम एल व्यू टाइप इन दिस एपिसोड आई विल शो यू हाउ टू पास वेरिएबल फ्रॉम व्यू डॉट एच टी एम एल पी एच पी पेज टू डिफॉल्ट डॉट पी एच पी पेज ओके सो Why we need? Because normally we cannot pass variable. So let's create a variable. Let's say username equal to Bishru. Now we want to get this value username in the default dot HTML PHP. So we simply uh, echo. So your username is and concatenate and print. So hopefully we are thinking that this will work. But let's try. So refresh this subscribe view. Now you are getting your username is, but the username is absent. So that means we are not able to pass data from view dot html to default dot php directly. We have to follow some convention. So what are the conventions? So here you have to create um, assign this variable to the um, class member variable. So how can we assign this? So dollar this. assign reference now you have to give a key name uh, like uh, anything username and now you have to pass the variable name which variable you want to pass that is user username so save and refresh let's check whether it is working or not still it's not working okay so um, why it's not working because we have um, defined and reference so we we cannot access directly we have to access through uh, the th as class variable so how can we access like using this pointer so dollar this username let's try this so it's working perfectly as you can see your username is bisharup so we are able to pass uh, data from view.html to default.php so you can um, make uh, that key name is different like etc so save and if you refresh then it will not work because we have to here the we have to mention the key name so save and try still it's working so this is the one way and actually internally it's creating an um, protected variable by assign ref so um, normally or, or other way we can also create like here so here right same thing we want to replicate like let me change the variable username and here username so let's refresh this uh, it's working okay now we will change this one reference now save we are not getting the username value so it's not working so now we will apply different method so here we will create different class variable so protected dollar username so we have created one class member variable now we will assign the value so how can we assign using this so dollar this username bisharu so save and try now it's working so this is the two method you can use so any uh, which you love you can use i have shown two different different method so in this way you can pass array also like uh, you have some data like users list users equal to jo so now um, here we can create same uh, thing we can create the protected also we can create like dollar this as an rep users dollar users so now um, in the view dot html here let's say we want to write um, in our content page content template okay so in the content template we can also access the values like components here default dot content here we can write like users 
lists so for each dollar this sorry dollar this users as dollar user echo li dollar user li okay we need one evil block let's copy this and paste so let's refresh the page so now we are getting user list bsu alum joe so in this way we can pass array variable any type class reference object anything so in this way we can pass uh, variable from um, view.html or different type so what happened uh, if we change the view format so let's check equal to raw so now um, nothing is uh, displaying because uh, we have not defined our um, variable in the view.raw.php that's why it's not working so let's uh, define these things like this one so open the view.raw.php here define this one so the user list will appear but your username is will not appear here so let's refresh this page so here you can see the list is appear because we have passed all the data now we will pass the data username so protected dollar username and dollar this username equal to test username save and run so this is working so in this way you can pass your variable from your view.html.php to your layout or template file as well as from different view format file thanks for watching this tutorial and if you have any comment suggestion feedback question write uh, your comment question suggestion below this video and please subscribe to my channel thank you have a good day